hello youtube i know all you guys out there have been anxious and waiting for the windows 10 upgrade and in today's video i'll be showing you guys how to upgrade your computer to windows 10 so here we are guys in order to get the windows 10 upgrade basically you just double click on the icon down at the bottom right here and then it will pop up and you just click I'm not sure what normally comes here but I think install Windows 10 but because mine has been downloaded already here it says we have the upgrade started so what we're gonna do is just accept and ensure that your computer is plugged in to your because you don't want your computer to run out of power before the upgrade is completed So we are now running the upgrade and it says to restart the computer so what I'm gonna do start upgrade now and I guess the computer basically gonna restart so as you can see it says configuring update for windows 10 so i'm just going to leave the camera rolling so you guys could see what's going on so as you can see guys this is the part where it shows it is upgrading to windows 10 your pc will restart several times all you need to do is just sit back and relax So as you can see guys, it seems like the Windows 10 is probably finished upgrading, I'm not sure, but I'm just going through, oh, these are some new features it basically comes with, and let's see what's going to happen. So I'm just going to put my password in. Now that my password is in, we are setting up some things. So let's see what they are setting up for me. I guess it's basically setting up my apps. So watch and see what's going on. Alright guys, so you have it. This is Microsoft Windows 10 so the update has been completed and what I'm just going to be doing is to check computer properties the system properties to see what it's like so there you go that's Windows 10 right there and the installation basically takes 30 minutes on this computer and the specification on this computer it has an SSD drive. I think it, it's a 256 gigabyte SSD, 6 gb RAM, an i3 processor with speed clock at 2.4 gigahertz. Okay, so what I'm going to be doing is a quick preview of the Windows 10. And if we click start and go to settings, but and go to Windows Update, and this is for users who are not comfortable using the windows 10 you go to recovery it allows you to go back to windows 7 and this option only available after available for a month after you have upgraded to windows 10 so i guess after a month passes you cannot go back to windows 7 so this is basically some of the feature here if you click the start you have your programs right here your most recent app use and this is a part of your metro style all in one area if you click all apps you see all the programs which is installed on your computer so let's see if we 
And if you take a look to your lower left hand corner, you have all your this one here is for your notification, which tells you everything what's going on with your device. And it has some quick, I would say, toggles right here where you could turn on and off and stuff like that. And if you go to all settings, it brings you back to the main settings and everything. So that's it basically. Thank you for watching. Feel free to comment, share, and subscribe. Goodbye.